Okay, we come to section C. Section C is short essays and it has 30 marks. So the instruction for this section is there are three parts in this section. Answer one question from each part. Okay, so answer one question from each part. Okay, that's all what that's what you need to do. You just answer one question from each part. Okay, so before we go on and answer the questions, I want to talk about a uh, few things that you need to do as you answer your uh, as you answer this question. Okay, or let me say this section. Okay, so one the first thing you need to do when you read the question, one thing you need to do is you need to come up with points related to the question okay make sure you just come up with points that are asked in the question okay that's what you need to do don't bring irrelevant points into this just i uh, bring out uh, varied points okay uh, the second point is the number of points you come up with should be at least equal to the number of marks okay so uh when they are, they have asked the questions the question and they have given you six marks at least come up with six points okay at least six points okay so you make sure you come up with six points at least that means you can if they have asked you a question and they are saying six marks you can come up with eight okay at least you can come up with eight or six, somewhere between that those numbers. Okay, how do you come up with eight? You come up with eight when you are not very sure of the other points you have raised. You can give additional two. Okay, and you can write them all. Now that depends on the lenience of the marker and the strategy the marker is going to use. Some markers will just mark the first six points. Some they will even go further and look for those meaningful points. If the two, the last two are okay, they will give you marks and get the all six marks. Okay. Then the other point you need to consider is write in paragraph form and not in point form. When you're writing short essay, please make sure you write in paragraph form. Write a passage. Write a paragraph. Okay. Just write a paragraph and don't put. Remember, it's a short essay. Short essay it's in English it's more or less like a summary. Okay, short essay is a summary in history or in geography, or it's just a summary. So you just write even one paragraph, don't put irrelevant points, just write points. Those points can be separated by commas, and later on you add the last sentence with a hand. Okay, and then you finish. Okay, the other point is don't add irrelevant don't add irrelevant information which i've already said don't add irrelevant information just to make the the essay to be longer don't add the irrelevant question remember these examiners these markers will have a lot of papers to match so they would appreciate if you just went straight to the points from point to point point to point point to point point to point just like that Okay, so basically that's what you need to do when you are uh, writing an exam, answering this section, just make sure you do those things. Without boring you with a lot of instructions, let's go straight to question number one.